So I have a question. Uh, do you think that your ideas, you're like uh, just a pioneer in this field, or you think that there is a, a group of people that, that is going to make it happen, or what is your vision? Right. Right. Thank you very much. Uh, it seems that there are expertise sprouting from everywhere, but the it is a way that has not yet been travelled. We don't really, it's futuristics, we don't know how it can go, and not only that, scientists are saying it can go a anywhere, and it can go, it, the, the future, and it's entirely plastic, entirely liquid, fluid, it can be, it can be created, it can be formed, so, so, it seems that innovation, the spirit of innovation, is what is going to be common, and a structure in which innovative people can connect with each other without the ages of, of government, or without the ages of corporations, or obstructions to their direct relationship and their ability to co-create. It sounds uh, like a radical change for the society. Well, you, you, it creates a, a structure a, a, where in which people know the the rules in which that they can interact. So that's what that's what law is. It's the ability to predict. It's that's what structures are. The 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 uh, the infant, the superstructure in which er, uh, other many different facets can. Uh, conduct and can uh, to co coalesce and can organize themselves around. So uh, there needs to be these things embedded in uh, in the system in advance of this amazing revolution which AI is uh, driving. But AI is just artificial intelligence in invented by humans and computed by computers, but. It's not going to create a new form of government uh, just artificially. It has to be somebody needs to bring the change. AI can be a tool of individuals to, to deal with the ex excesses of government. Because government is using huge power. Uh, which is unmatched by any citizen or corporation, and th and they're often not the just. It's unjust, and as time goes by, when systems are older, but circumstances are newer, there is more and more injustice. So, and it's very hard to speak the language of this injustice because it works in such a way. It's the structure. In which things work, so you can't blame it for overt justice until it gets to its worst state. It's usually and it usually takes a long time to do that. But you can create counter instruments which will deter and not make it worthwhile for the state to pursue and I and and to create incentives where the state will adopt best practices which will reflect and which will allow for a structure in which its citizenry can can flourish uh, it is not it is not uh, entirely taken for granted it should not be entirely taken for granted that the state will do what's best for its citizenship but what it may be easiest or they may think that the citizenry will not tolerate re great revolution so who would put their head out to make revolution uh, but if this a great society can be achieved. It's the time now to do so with the tools in hand. And if the tools are there in hand, it's the time now to embed a in a, a philosophic superstructure uh, infrastructure to uh, to the process. And what is that different from utopia? Well, utopia is uh, is said to be no place. It does not exist. What is it is it is a very naive idea of a form of utopia. Obviously, that there is always going to be 
uh, challenge and struggle, but the, with the uh, with the very idea, it is a, it in many ways it 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 is a utopia because one can argue that in the past there was not the computing power to be able to match certain one person's proclivities to another person's needs, but if if that matchability is possible, then most most of people's uh, nuanced characteristics and variations have partnership, a co-creative partnership. And when people partner and they are empowered, mutually empowered, that creates and in, in groups of two and then three and then uh, and then complex processes of groups, the power emerging, the significance emerging from these collaborations of people is incredible and disproportionate. So, and not only that, but it empowers those individuals who know now that with cooperation with each other and each other's unique skills, they can, they can, uh, the result can be disproportionate. That too is an intellectual tool. They now know the coordinates to success and that too can be reproduced.